couldn't run our business without IT at the moment. It runs our materials planning, scheduling, administration, and increasingly it's being used in customer interfaces. We're Crawford, Hansard and Kimmer Limited. We're designers and manufacturers of short-run electronic sub-assemblies and wound components. We've been in business since 1963. We have a net worth of about half a million pounds and we employ about 30 people. In the supply chain, we are principally a subcontractor. In global manufacturing terms, we are a second or third tier supplier. We first put a website up a couple of years ago. We now have the opportunity um, of becoming much more aggressive and uh, using it to market with a rifle shot to customers we want. The uh, second thing worth mentioning about websites is that we put up uh, early on uh, an inquiry form, and that's disciplined us uh, in a way to answer more quickly, and we get more specific inquiries. To give you an example of how we use this, um, these electronic systems in our business, um, I could cite one of our large customers which is a global American air conditioning company. Um, we've worked with them for many years, and we've uh, Europeanized some of their designs, and we know them well. Um, at the moment, we have a database of all their relevant parts, which we can call up when we want. Um, the mechanism is that they send us in a schedule. Um, our estimator looks at that. Um, our sales office manager then produces schedule which becomes uh, the backbone of our business. And it runs through manufacturing, which is itself includes stock control, um, batching up parts, and actual manufacture right through to dispatch. Um, alongside that are labels representing the individual parts, which are generated from our master database for that customer. Yeah, yeah. So we're integrated right through from receiving the schedule from the materials planning system from our large customer right through to dispatch. And ultimately, those goods are delivered to that customer who then enters it back into his system using those same part numbers. From a business point of view, you really have to take account of the cost of the whole project, which is probably two or three times the cost of the actual capital expenditure because of the change in work practices, um, the inv people investment involved, and, and so on. As far as the large companies go, the business-to-business -business relationship is altering radically, and that's an opportunity for us and a threat for those who can't take part in it. Key to manufacturing and design business today is to increase your productivity, and the only way to do that is using IT. Bite your lip, be brave, and adopt it.